Hey, 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 ladies and gents, this is your old son of Brandon Plain, and we are back here with a new game, uh, well, newish to me, at least. It's called Project Cat. Um, a little bit in a different sense. It is a horror-based RPG. Um, and it sounds very, very loud, so we're actually going to turn it down a little bit if we have to. So I do like this. It is it is from Itch.io. There is another um let's get the sound settings here. Yeah. How oh, we do that. Game settings, language English, skip dialogue on. Um, let's do Eh, we'll keep it on. Screen settings. We won't mess with these right now, even though they are there. It would have been nice to be able to have them uh, prior to this, but we are set with what we're set here. So the control settings are a little bit odd. It is... No, does it... It does not use WASD. It is directional pad, which is weird. So the action is Z or enter. The run is shift. Special is C. Keyboard classic. I wonder if there's a way to be able to... WASD. There we are. Okay. That makes that makes it a little bit easier there. Um, so the run is still shift. WASD. The action is the E key. The special is the Q. That makes a lot more sense to me. All right. Good thing that we checked into that. Let's get into Project Cat. Paper Lily Prologue. It looks like an absolutely absolutely gorgeous game no mouse usage in this whatsoever which is a little oh oh this is so pretty WASD to move okay okay so pretty. Any action? All right, so nothing to do with the trees. Eat or interact with the environment. Okay. Q is the special. I remember that. There's a white flower on the ground. Pick up items with Q. Um, this is weird. Oh. Paint white flower. Open the menu to see your items. Okay. This is inventory. White flower found appear in the grass. It appears to be a lily, I think. Okay. Building a head seems locked somehow. In three out of four, yeah. If you use an item, stand close and select the item from the menu. Okay. All right. So yeah, this this lily there, obviously. Flower sank into the water. That does not sound like a flower going into the water. What the hell? Pity. You thought that would work? You should be more careful about the decisions you make. The solution may seem obvious, but... There is always another way. I actually really like this. You may notice it right away. But your actions will have an impact sooner or later. You may not even remember what you did to cause it. Sadly, regret is always the shadow of choice. Also, you know very well this isn't your home. So why do you mess with things that don't belong to you? You're not welcome here. Look. This is the result of your actions. The result of your expectations. Things are not always what they seem. What do you think? 
Does this still look like a flower to you? You're not prepared to deal with the truth, are you? I can't stop you from coming here, but if you're foolish enough to cross my path, I'll kill you myself. Dude! Holy hell did this get freaking, this go from zero to 60 in like 2.2. Such is the way of our world. I am getting such major Undertale vibes from this. Such major Undertale vibes from this. I love it. Absolutely love it already. Um, And speaking of which, this really, I have Undertale. I'm going to be playing Undertale for the first time. Um, Going to try, be trying to play it on, I, I don't know, stream or on, on, on YouTube. But either way, like this is hyping me up for that. Oh. Whoa, weird dream. Everyone must be gone already. Looks like it's 11. I should get to it. 11 p.m.? Dude, I love this. Project Cat Paper Lily Prologue. Ponytail Girl. Oh no. You moved it. I didn't, I swear. You know I hate this type of thing. I can't... This possibly can't be happening. It's spelled die. Oh my. Oh no. Stop joking around. This is serious. Oh. We should not have played this. I told you we're going to be cursed. Why is your window open? Like, if you're playing around with a Ouija board, you close your damn fucking windows. 100%. I don't care. I'm on the 12th floor. If I'm playing around with a Ouija board, that door is barricaded, and that window, the windows are closed. Because I don't care. Anything that comes at me is going to be able to get up 12 stories. Let's face it. You close that window. Close it. Now. Is that a ghost? We sent him to ghost! Oh my god, oh my god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. You're making too much noise. Oh, it's just cat. What's with that crazy knocking? What was that for? That spook you? You're not supposed to be here, you know. Oh god, maybe I don't like cat too much. Say the same about you. Why are you here? Actually, say hello to the new member of the occult club. I had the wonderful opportunity to meet all of the members yesterday. I don't recall seeing you there. You three are not part of the club, are you? That's funny. I didn't pin all of you. You of all people is the occult type cat. That's because I'm not. Hey, we're doing something here. See the trouble. All three of you moved it. Huh? The planchette from your game. You all moved it. There's no ghost in the room. There's a simple scientific explanation. It's called the ED motor effect. Simply put, just like your body reacts to pain reflectively, you may also react to ideas and move on its own. It pretty much bypasses the part of the brain that we use for conscious behavior. It's not all that different from blinking or breathing. The effect is even stronger when a bunch of gullible people who are desperate to believe in ghost stories get together and play. <laughs> Dear Lord, Cat is freaking... She, she, she's... She's savage. Savage. There was an experiment where the players were blindfolded and suddenly ghosts could no longer spell messages. You can try it if you don't believe me. In other words, your mysterious answers from beyond are just your imagination playing tricks on you. Great job killing the mood. You must be fun at parties. Thanks a lot, cat. Always a pleasure. Alright, time to search. I should go over my notes to make sure I didn't forget anything. All right, so. Just saying. 
Just saying. The stuffed crow. Interesting choice of decoration. The crows can save your game. Save often since the future is uncertain. Oh my god. Like, this is a legit RPG. I love it. A spherical model of Earth. Red crosses mark certain locations. An expensive looking radio. Turn it on. Yeah, let's bug them. What are you even doing? Just looking around. Some books and jars filled with something. A crystal ball resting on a cushion. Wow, that cheap plastic exterior really makes it look authentic. <laughs> cool breeze blows, blows in from outside. Close the window? Oh, yes. Drawer won't open. Some small plants. Their quiet existence fascinates you. Drawer underneath is empty. Suspicious news articles and posters representing magic circles. That's actually a pentagram. But okay. The book entitled Magic Circles for Simpletons. Truth behind mermaids exposed. Creepy cryptids and where to find them. Like, this reminds me of Harry Potter. There's some chalk here. Take chalk? Yes. Obtained chalk. Draw something on the chalkboard. Yes. What should I draw? A flower. A self-portrait. A house. A butt! Don't draw. A flower. A self-portrait. A house. A butt. I think we have to do what we have to do. Draw that booty. It's done. This is the most pointless thing you've done today. My favorite mas fabulous masterpiece is displayed here. It's a box for the game the girls were playing. It says Ouija game board for two to four players. Get answers from beyond. We take no responsibility for adverse, any adverse effects playing this game shall cause you or your loved ones. Such a disappointment, I presume. She's really concentrated on fixing her ribbon. Best not disturb her. Bet you think you're so funny. We have other plans for the night anyway. Whatever you say. That's why you're not leaving, right? What are you looking at? Uh, your bag. Clearly. It's this bull bag. There's something shiny inside. Do you need something? Maybe later. Dear lord, what is this game? Cardboard marked with the symbol. They're sealed with tape. This runes... The runes my friend mentioned may be in here, but I need a way to open it. Objectives updated, huh? Trash can seems to be full. Okay, so I need a way to open... A... Box... Thick purple book. A spell book. It's weird. It also looks fake. Oh. Let's go back. There's something shiny inside. You need something. Maybe later. No, I... You got to be... Must be stuck somehow. No. Drawer underneath is empty. Do I leave? Make, read my notes. Uh, <laughs> check your notes to refresh your memory. Okay. Uh, find a way to open the box with the runes. Okay. Oh. Three rooms, 12 candles, a lighter, a rune, a tuft of hair, chalk. Oh, we have the chalk. Sort the desks in each classroom. Turn out the lights and draw the curtains in each classroom. Draw a path... What am I doing here? What am I... Alright, so I need to search school for these items first. What exactly am I doing here? Alright, so I do leave the... No running in the hallways. While moving old ship to run. Oh my god, she is fast. Wow. Alright, let's see. According to my notes, I need to move the desks to the sides in all three classrooms. So I can draw a path in the middle of each one with chalk. Well, I'll leave the chalk drawing for last. I want to gather everything I need first. Okay, I get that. Yes. Uh, 
Oh. I didn't realize that that was how I did that. I thought you actually did this, not just like this. Huh. This thing's things a lot quicker, honestly. I really like this, though. That was easy. Oh, there's a pair of scissors here. Take scissors? Hell yeah! Some geometry books. So those are the scissors that I need to be able to get into... <laughs> the contents look very trashy. Any of these are scissors I need to do with this. Um, let's cut this open. There's a bunch of useless trash in here, and that little box may be it. Three runes, but the ritual didn't mention a specific one. Which one should I take? I don't know. The B, protective rune. Okay. Locked. He's downstairs, not at school. Should be able to find everything I need on this floor. No need to go downstairs. Okay. Alright, that's the same classroom there. Okay. So, with the dust in this classroom now? Yes. Let's get started. Oh, God. Um. Okay. Can I some yeah, I, I can. Cool. Wait, what? Oh, shit. Ah, it's gonna make me redo all that. Damn. Much better. That's fine. We're not going to take the risk. We're not going to risk it. There we go. There we go. Alright. What is in this room now. Geography textbook. Some textbooks you don't care about. These other things that I need to... Some boring textbooks. Some classroom attendance sheets to schedule. So basically, some of these rooms are going to have something, some of them are going to have nothing. Okay. Teacher's podium. There's a useless history book here as well. Oh, I didn't even realize I could walk up here, by the way. Just saying. Books and chalk. Take it? Yeah, we'll take the extra chalk. But the more the merrier. <laughs> so there's other places that I should have searched in that other room. Like here. No, we don't need that chalk. need to know if there's anything special, and I don't think there is. So if we go to the objectives here, gather him to ritual, which talk, chalk, candles, a rune, 
and a tuft of hair. Oh, and I also need to shut the curtains in all three classrooms. Which I have not done until that point. So, do I dare grab... <laughs> do I dare, like, cut their hair? Um... <laughs> hey, girls are did you just oh my god what have you done get the hell out at least i got what i did I, i'm guessing I, oh i can't go back in there okay i didn't think i was gonna be able to go back in all right i i, I got what i did <laughs> i did not expect that at all i did not expect that at all Okay, um, so we got everything needed for the rituals. We just need to sort the three rooms. Oh, curtains here are missing. According to the ritual instructions, I need to black out all the rooms. But we're like, find new curtains. All right, so we got to find new curtains. I didn't think that was going to be that simple. All right, that's literally it. Sort the dust in this classroom. Yes. Let's do this! Okay. Um... Pretty simple and straightforward here. simple too. Oh sh Nikes. No it's not. I just messed that up. Damn it. One false move messes that whole thing up. Yikes. Two false moves mess that whole thing up. Three mess ups. Dear Lord man. Usually, normally very good at these puzzles. All right. Normally very, very good at these puzzles. Okay, so I actually want to do this. That's what I wanted to do. Woo. All right. Encyclopedias will definitely steer this. This is already heavy. Let's keep potted plants. Boring textbooks. Paper slips, shells, rules, regulations. We're said are not allowed on school grounds at night. Huh. We'll never know if I need to read it. Never read it. Sheets and attendance schedules. So where are these? I'm assuming it's just going to say chalk. We don't need to do the chalk. It's useful of the void. Or it's useless of the void items. Or in trash can. Maybe we'll find some curtains in here. wonder if any girls is a member of this club. Not in grim terms with them, though. How am I going to open it now? Um, yeah, maybe I should have waited to cut their hair off, huh? Yeah. Maybe slightly. Don't talk to me anymore. I won't forget this. Oh my god. Get out of my face. Okay, this might not work very well. The school bag. There's something shiny inside. What if I accidentally push the bag off the chair? Push the bag? Yes. What the? I'm so sorry. Dear Liam, I need to pick that up for you. 
Did I get the key for the theater room? Yeah, theater club key. Okay. I'll be out of your hair now. <laughs> did, did you get that? She'll be out of her hair now. <laughs> out of her hair. I love this, by the way. Like, I really legitimately... Like, this... Theater club key. But I have the key now. Oh. That's right, you have to go in the inventory. They are too heavy to use as curtains. Thief. Alright, can I take? Yes. I mean, technically now I am. Paint and brushes, various makeup kits. Oh, I, I guess uh, I could have totally. Can I take a hat? Ah. All right. So I got the curtain. I'm just waiting for the jump scare to come. Like you know, there's going to be a point where there is, right? He should do the trick. Perfect. All right. Objectives updated. Draw path chalk in all three car rooms. Set and light the candles in the middle room. Okay. So this is the middle room currently. Oh. got so quiet. Here comes the scare points. There was someone in that room. Okay. Creepy creepiness. Two down, one to go. Like, I saw someone in that room there. That window shattered. Super freaking dark, or super quiet all of a sudden. Bunch of candles, I need those for the ritual. I need to put them on every single... Okay, I, di I didn't need to put it on every single one. It's just each side. Okay, so it's going to make me do it twice. All right. Objectives. Set and light the candles in the middle room. Um, do I have a lighter? I do. Seems kind of weird that a kid is carrying around a lighter, but so be it. All right. Is everything going to go to hell now? Everything's ready. All that's left is wait five minutes and then burn the hair. This is going to be such a pain to clean up. Seriously, stop messing with things. But everything I mess with ends up being a scam. What if someday it isn't? What if you end up summoning some ghost or the devil or condemning your soul to an eternity in another world? What if your soul is already damned? Then I guess that's what's waiting for me after I die. Cat! It was a joke. You're not going to find him this way, you know. You'll just do whatever you want no matter what I say, won't you? It's possible. Stubborn idiot. I prefer ambitious idiot. So, will you tell me where this letter is? You exhaust me, cat. You know that? Yet here we are. Fine, you win. It's in the occult club. It's a gold envelope. 
in one of the drawers, but they won't let you sniff around since you're not a member. Thanks, you're the best. Uh, is there someone at the door? Don't just go check. What is my objective? Burn the tuft of hair on a candle. Yeah. All right, it's been five minutes, right? Let's do this. And now I just have to blow the candles. Huh? The candles, they just... I guess I should count to 100. One, two, three, four, five. 28, 29, 30. Why am I doing this? This ridiculous game couldn't possibly work. 55, 56, 57, 58. I wonder if mom is worried about me. Huh? What was that? 79, 80, 81. What's all that noise? Is anyone here? 97, 98, 99. 100. So I open my eyes. Oh, it just went to side scroller. It worked. It worked. It worked. I can't believe it. This is incredible. But where am I? It's a, it's a hallway. This definitely isn't the school. This is unbelievable. How could it have worked? It doesn't make any logical sense. I was in the classroom a minute ago. Have I gone mad? This is so exciting. I can't believe it worked. If I wake up from it, it turns out to be a dream. Well, that would be disappointing to say the least. Okay, I definitely need to check this place out. Do you like to save your progress? Yes. Oh my God. I am absolutely loving this to the point that we are going to come back and play more of this. Um, this is great. I am loving, loving, loving this. But we, uh, that's all the time I have for now. If you guys enjoyed the content, make sure to drop a sub on the channel, ring that notification bell, and smash that like button. If you'd like to see me live over on Twitch, it's twitch.tv forward slash random planet. As always, guys, let the spoopy be with you. This was fantastic, and I do want to finish it. We will be finishing it in increments, though. I uh, <laughs> let the spoopy be with you. And during these tough times, please remember you, your friends, your family, and your loved ones. Please stay safe out there. We will see you guys again in the next random scary games video. Bye-bye. See you guys later. Bye. This was amazing. I love it. It's like it's like the new Undertale. <laughs>